Hey everyone, it's People Studios 97 here. Hey guys. And I'm in Rose Four. You almost forgot your intro. Oh, uh, all right. Yeah. Off to a great start. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> So if you remember, we were gonna do that Q and A video or whatever. So uh, we're still we're still doing it. Sorry, it was a little delayed, <laughs> but that's okay because we're here today. Just uh, we had some technical problems along the way, so mm -hmm. uh, we're here now. So yeah, we're I guess we have the questions here on the computer. Simon's filming with the iPhone, <laughs> doing some selfie mode. Or <laughs> I've never taken one before, so neither have I. Yes. <laughs> Let's see here. From Nico Boy, this first question says, Brain, Simon, that I said, nice to meet you. Well, uh, nice, nice to meet to you meet too, you. I guess, Nico Boy, but yeah. <laughs> but yeah, okay. That was more of a recommendation, I guess. But... Alright, so, Zobi and Me says, Okay, so he posted this, he says the day it's due. <laughs> Don't worry, man, it was actually, it, that was three weeks ago when he posted that. The day it was due was actually a couple days ago, so you're fine, but he says, If you could take one Sonic plush out of your collection and lose the rest, which one would it be? Both people answer. Uh, I guess you could go first. I'll have to think about this one. Sonic. Yeah. Sonic or Tails. Yeah, Sonic or Tails. Shadow's cool, too. You know, they're all great, but I don't know. Sonic and Tails, they're like the first ones we got, and you know, I don't know, the main characters. And they're, and they're really cool, too, so yeah. Art from DBZ Sonic Fan 23. For both of us, he says, how was it having the experience filming episodes and playing the characters? Um, you know, filming the episodes, it was really fun. It was a good time. Just from the first one that we made three years ago, it's crazy that it's been that long already, but I can't believe it myself. But uh, I would really, I, it's a good experience. It was, it's really fun. And um, just being with your friend, you know, it's fun. And, uh, it's like Playing we make character. jokes yeah. in between. Exactly, the yeah, stuff. yeah. It, it's it's fun. never a boring time, yeah. you know. It's, it's, it's fun, fun. Uh, like playing the role of the character. It is, yeah. Cause it's like, oh, hey, I'm Sonic and Tails <laughs> here, you know. But yeah, it's it's awesome. So thanks, and it's it's also great to have awesome fans like you guys. So thank you, Nico Boy again. Oh, okay. He just said, all right, okay. <laughs> all right, Omega Knuckles fan. He says to both of us, what are some other game franchises you like? Uh, that's a good question. Uh, I really like the Uncharted series for the PlayStation 3. Those are always great. I'm excited for the fourth one, but I don't have a PS4, so... And, um, uh, Little Big Planet. Those are... That's always a good time. Um, Mario. I love Mario. One of the first games I ever played. Sly Cooper. That's a good one. How about you, Simon? I'd say Kingdom Hearts, Sly Cooper, Pokemon, Legend of Zelda. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Legend. You can't forget <laughs> Zelda. <laughs> That's, those are all good ones. Let's see, uh, from Di Diamond Donut, <laughs> that's a funny name, you, to, to both of you, how long is the movie is? Uh, well, the movie, it's gonna be... Oh, gosh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I have some, some technical difficulties. The movie's gonna be, like, uh, an hour, so it's not gonna be, like, super long. Like, it's not gonna be Lord of the Sonic, Lord of the Rings, or whatever. Not, <laughs> not like, Sonic. three hours long, but... <laughs> Lord of the Rings. Yeah, oh yeah, it right. works, that works, yeah. But, but yeah. no, we'll, we won't make that. <laughs> yeah, probably just like, you know, roughly an hour, one hour, an hour. And yes. You're not going to see anything super long, yeah. so. Let's see. From Sweetheart6781, she says to both of us, or he, I don't know, to both of us, will you guys keep your Sonic plushes or sell them? Definitely keep them, because, I don't know, it'd be hard to get rid of them, you know, just throw our cast out, but, yeah. What would you say? Keep them. <laughs> yeah, I would say so too. Uh, Orange Dairy says, "What's your favorite Sonic game, B-Boy?" Uh, you know, there's a lot of good ones out there. There's some bad ones. You know, Sonic 06, Sonic Labyrinth. Those. Uh, but yeah, I would say if there's one that I really, really like, it'd be Sonic Adventure 2. And uh, a close second, or second, I can't count. Close <laughs> second would be Sonic Colors. So yeah. And this one's for me. It says, "What's your favorite Mario game?" That's, uh, there's a lot of good Mario games. Uh, Mario 64 was the first one I ever played, so that's probably up there. And Mario Galaxy, that's, that's a good one, too. Alright, and this one's for me, from Orange Dairy as well. That last one was from Orange Dairy, too, so. He says, for B-Boy, how do you edit? Well, let's see, I got it right here. This might be hard, but... Okay, well, yeah, anyways, you know what, I, you know what I'm talking about. I have a Pinnacle Studio, and, uh, that's, that's basically how I edit, and, uh, yeah, it's really fun. It's a good program, so if you ever have the chance to get it, it's really good. It's a little complex, but I like it. 
this is for both of us from Nameless Saturn T. He says, what games do you play? Well, and the basically other one, the yeah, ones basically the one said. down there, you know, Perfect. Mario, Sonic, stuff like that. Uh, MC Bammer 13 he says, what inspired you, B-Boy, to do stop motion Sonic and Tails and Saint Adventures? Um, you know, stop motion, Sonic Toast, I'm sure you've heard of that channel, and Super Sonic Boom, those were both really big inspirations for the stop motions because they're just fun to do, you know? Like, uh, I had a good time doing them, and, uh... Yeah, you know, it, it was fun, and um, I had a good time doing it. I kind of dropped them recently due to other projects, but for Sonic and Tails Insane Adventures, honestly, it was just us bored one day when we made the Insane series, and um, yeah, and it just took off from there because we found out it was pretty popular. You guys liked it, so uh, yeah, we just continued it from there. All right, so this one's for both of us, too. Uh, it says, how excited were you when you were going to release Exodus Part 3? I was really excited because I thought it would probably be the best episode. Yeah, I honestly series. think it was. Um, yeah. It it was good. Uh, I really love doing the Exodus series because, you know, throughout the whole series, there's been some intense moments, but mostly just <laughs> comedy. So, like, for Exodus, it was, most, it was like, pretty tense, you know, because, like, stuff's getting serious, you know, between all those guys. If you haven't seen them, you should go check it out because we put a lot of effort into those videos. And, yeah. uh... It's been a big project uh, that we've worked on, and part three is always, it's either hit or miss because <laughs> it's the closure to the, you know, special, so. The actual, like, series. Yeah, exactly, the yeah. It, the, like, it closes the series, but it opens up the movie. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. So I was excited, and I think it paid off because you guys seem to like it, so, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, this is to both of us. Will Rouge be in one of the movies? Uh, well, we're just gonna make one more movie, so probably not now. <laughs> Sorry, we don't have our schedule. And I, <laughs> a Rouge plush goes for like a hundred dollars, so I don't know. We don't even have our scripted, oh, wow. so yeah. But yeah, that's that's a good question. Oh yeah, by the way, that last one that we read, the Exodus Part Three, that was Gene Luck Picard, and this one that I just read about Rouge was Pablo Morales. Okay, Stormtrooper nine three four asks to both of us. What are your favorite Sonic games and Mario games? Um, now you can go first. I don't know. I'd I'll say think, uh, this one. for Sonic games, uh, Sonic Colors. I really like Sonic Generations. Oh, I just wish it would be a bit longer. Oh, uh, yeah. Both of those games short. are pretty short. And then uh, Sonic Boom looks like it might be pretty fun. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, and then for Mario games, I'd say Mario Galaxy. Mm -hmm, that's Maybe. Good one. I'm not really sure, because, all right, Mario Galaxy and then Mario Sunshine. Because oh, yeah. Mario Sunshine was really good. fun. <laughs> uh, you know, I would say Sonic I already pretty much answered. Sonic Adventure 2, and then I also like Sonic Colors and Generations, like Sonic <laughs> Simon said. But, uh, yeah, also I wish those would have been longer. But um, Mario, Mario, I guess I answered that too. <laughs> so Mario 64, Mario Galaxy. And then, you know, Double Dash, uh, Mario Kart, and, uh, Mario Party. Both, oh, yeah, I both forgot about Mario too. Kart. Yeah. To both, are there going to be Dr. Eggman? Uh, no, probably not, <laughs> no. Well, actually, if you watch the, uh, what's it called? The old Jailhog episode, I think it is, when they're playing Dr. Robotnik's Mean Bean Machine. Oh, yeah. Sonic says, you know, Eggman might not. <laughs> he goes, hey. Why are we laughing? Yeah, I don't know, I don't know. Where he's like, you know, League Man might not have been cool when he's alive, but he made a pretty cool game. So that was just kind of a sign that Eggman's actually dead mm. in the insane adventures world. So yeah, that's why you never see him because he's gone. So yeah, um, this to both. Why did you guys start making YouTube videos, and will you ever stop making YouTube videos? Uh well, we started because just because it looked fun, and it, it is, you know, we yeah. have a good time. So, it's cool, uh, like, making videos for you guys, you know? Yeah, and that yeah, you guys really like them, you know, it's it's awesome. So that that's basically it. And uh, to the answer, will you ever stop making videos? You know, sometime, you know, we I mean, have to, yeah. but no time soon, so don't worry. We'll, we'll be sticking with you guys for much, long, much longer, so, yeah. We're going strong as long as we can. <laughs> yeah, exactly, yeah. Uh, this, oh yeah, that, oh my gosh, why do I keep forgetting the name? For the, are there going to be Dr. Eggman? Uh, that was M. Scout Law 3078. 
Mustard Sheeps asked the question we just at, uh, that he we just read about the uh, will you ever stop making YouTube videos? So I won't make that mistake again. <gasps> Sorry guys. Okay, Gramball 6 to B Boy. Which spy versus spy from Mad Magazine's characters are, is your favorite, black or white spy? Uh, I haven't really read the magazines, but I've seen a couple of the shorts. They're pretty funny. Uh, hmm. You know, they're both pretty good, I guess. Um, white spy is pretty cool. You know. Um, let's see. <laughs> Someone actually said, oh my gosh, I have that same Batman sweater. That was from, uh, Xena Fernandez. I, sorry if I'm butchering your name, but, uh, yeah. That's cool. Batman's awesome, so yeah. And this is to both from Supersonic 88, uh, Super Super Sonic 88. <gasps> <laughs> super Super. Alright, so let's see. Super Super. Would, you, would either of you like to voice act for other people such as myself? Uh, you know, I would, but... I don't know, I might be a little busy for that. I don't yeah. know, how about you, Simon? I mean, we're working on mm. stuff of our own right now. Yeah, like, yeah. Like, a little secret that, project. That's yeah. nice, yeah, yeah. That's a nice question, but, uh, sorry, we're a little busy yeah. for that. But thanks. Uh, Super Don Bros asks, to both of us, how long does it take to make an episode of Insane Adventures? Includes editing, scripting, filming, exporting, uploading. You know, uh, pretty long time, um... You know, scripting, getting the actual idea down, and then that takes, I don't know, like maybe a week or so. Edit, uh, scripting takes probably takes the longest. Filming's definitely shorter, like a day, maybe two. For more complex episodes, two. Like Exodus took longer. Mm -hmm. uh, each individual part took longer than an episode, normal episode. And uh, upload... Uh, Editing, sorry, I forgot to mention that. Editing uh, takes quite a while, especially for Exodus when we had all, you know, the fireballs <laughs> and the electricity shots. That took quite a bit of time. And, um, yeah, and then uploading takes really long if it's, like, a long project. Like, Exodus Part 3, I actually uh, started it at, like, 4 o'clock p.m., and when I came upstairs to go to bed, I was like, oh, my gosh, it was, like, 30% complete, so I had to leave my computer on while I slept. And when I woke up in the morning, it was 95% complete, so it took, it takes and quite then, some time. Did it just, like, stay at 95% for us? Yeah, for it time? did, It was yeah. so weird. It was weird, yeah. And so, yeah, I don't know. The longer the episode, the longer the upload, I guess. But, uh, let's see. Super Super Sonic 88, he's back, he says, to both of us, will you ever need voice actors in future projects? Uh... Sorry, man, we're really raining on your parade here, but uh, probably not. No, basically we just do the stuff, and then we're having some friends come in. So, I mean, if the time comes up, yeah, we'll go look for you, but mm -hmm. right now, not really. Sorry. Miles Prower, he asked to both, what is your favorite Sonic game and why? Uh, <laughs> Sonic Adventure 2, just same reasons as the other ones. I'd probably say... Uh... Probably Sonic Generations, because mm -hmm. it was like, it was the actual first Sonic game that I actually bought, and I really liked the gameplay and stuff like that, and yeah, I liked how it was yeah. like classic mode, it was like sideways, yeah, and like yeah. modern. Yeah, that was really cool, that was cool. And Sonic Adventure 2, I just like it, because all the, like, you can play as Sonic, Tails, <laughs> Knuckles, and Eggman, Rouge, Shadow, that was really cool. I also really liked uh, Sonic and the Black Knight. Oh yeah, that was a good one. That was good. The bot. I actually, it was. I thought it was underrated. I mean, I can see why people don't like it. It's nothing like. It's not. It's Sonic not really games. like a Sonic game. But it's. I thought it was alright. Yeah. You know, it, battle mode was pretty fun. Except <laughs> they move so slow. Yeah. They're like tanks. All right. Let's see. Bowser Junior Adventures says to B Boy Studios and the Monroe's Four, who inspired you to make Sonic and Tails Insane Adventures? Boredom, pretty much. Yeah, <laughs> we're bored, so we made it. Uh, if there was anyone that basically... Wasn't there that, uh, that Mario? Oh, yeah, Mario Mario 89. That's it. Yeah, yeah. Mario Mario 89 89. He was a... I know he doesn't make Sonic stuff, but he was a really big inspiration, and his his videos are really cool. So that's a little shout-out to you, Mario Mario 89. So, 89 89. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, uh... Mars Ellis asks, What's your favorite video you've made to B-Boy? Uh, that's a good question, you know, um, cause there's been so many, you know, a lot of people like Tales to Altair, a lot of people like Exodus, which is good because we worked really hard on that. 
I would say the Exodus series, uh, if any part in particular, two or three, because I really like them. Because you know that's when stuff gets more suspenseful, so yeah. Okay, Supersonic1081 asks to both of us, uh, ha if you, I guess, you I'd, said, yeah, had you, to put in a so, video game character in Sonic and Tails and Saint Adventures, who would you put in and why? Uh, hmm. I'd say, uh... We talked about Silver in the past, but mm -hmm. we never got around to it, <laughs> but yeah. Uh, Zelda, and uh, not Zelda, Link, Link, or Zelda, Zelda. School. I'd say... For me, personally, I'd say, like, Donkey Kong. I think he'd be a pretty funny uh, Yeah, yeah, he would be cool. Uh, let's see. Or maybe even, like, Bowser, you know? Bowser so, would be cool, yeah, yeah. I remember already got Mario and Luigi and Peach. And I remember so. one time, it was a very long time ago, we <laughs> were just, like, making these little Mario sort of shorts yeah, for fun. Yeah, yeah, we posted one. And uh, in one of the episodes we made, it was... Bowser, but it was but just like, it in was a reality, it was a puppet primantis, <laughs> and we just said, oh, it's old Bowser, you know? So, yeah, we, ne we never do good with the villains. They're either dead or they're primantises. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. How is your plans for the future of your channel? And that's from Matthew the Human. Uh, he didn't really say who was to, so I guess it's just for both of us, but, uh, for the future of our channel, you know, we're not getting rid of it. I know some people were wondering, oh, hey, since you're getting rid of Sonic and Tails and Adventures, is the whole ship going down? <laughs> but no, nah, we're, we're keeping the channel for as long as we can. There's and, actually uh, a video called Secret Project 2014. Yeah, 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 there's a trailer. Yeah. We, can't, we can't tell you anything about it, but yeah. it's just a secret project. And so. then, uh, you know, friends coming, doing short videos just for fun, mm -hmm. Most, mostly comedy-based, so yeah, nothing like series-wise, but we are going to do a new series soon, so mm -hmm. yeah, that's something to look forward to. Alright, let's see, uh, Super Dawn Bros, he's back, he says, another question, what inspired you to make Sonic and Tails Insane Adventures, and why are you stopping? Can't you just take ideas from your fans? Well, it's not really like we're running out of ideas, yeah. it's, it's just like... We want to end it at the perfect spot, you know. We exactly, don't. We don't yeah. want to keep going and make it like, oh, Sonic has like, <laughs> I don't know. It's like yeah. a Nickelodeon show or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a perfect example of not ending where it's supposed to. Uh, sorry if any of you guys like new SpongeBob, but SpongeBob should not still be going. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys, because it, they were gonna end it after the movie, but they wanted to make more money, so greed got in their way, and so yeah, so they just kept making it, and now it's not even good. I think like if you've ever seen the series Lost, it's kind of like ending it at the perfect yeah, spot. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's a good example. Because like how, I know how some they, people don't yeah. like the ending, but we liked it, you mm -hmm. know. So yeah. Okay, let's and yeah. Oh yeah, <laughs> I guess there's more to this question. What inspired you to make insane adventures? You know, Mario, Mario eighty nine, and boredom, and then. Uh, can't, uh, can't you just take ideas from your fans? I don't know. Um, that'd be a little difficult. Mm. But, yeah. I think just ending it where we need to end it is what we need to do, you know? Mm -hmm. uh, Shad Amy Lover 15 asks, to both of us, how long have you guys been Sonic fans? Uh, you know, it's kind of been... I, when I first played Sonic Adventure 2, I wasn't really a huge fan. But, uh, I guess... Around 2007, 8, around there, was when I started to like Sonic a lot more, and, uh, yeah. How about you? Well, since I grew up on the Nintendo, I mm -hmm, I was yeah, playing yeah. a lot of Wind Waker and, uh, let's see, Mario Sunshine. So oh. I wasn't really a big Sonic fan when I was little, but around, like, 2008, probably. Yeah. I became, like, a bigger Sonic fan. Mm-hmm, same here, yeah. And, uh... Sonic Boom Shad asks, to B-Boy and the Monroe's 4, how would you react if Sonic was voiced by Simon and Tails was voiced by Brian? I mean... Hey, Sonic, how's it going? The voice is too deep. Hey, hey. <laughs> yeah. I hey, don't know. Tails. I guess. I mean, if, <laughs> if we were better at the voices, I guess it wouldn't be weird. It would yeah, be weird I right mean, now because we've been voicing them for three years. Yeah, but if we just decided mm -hmm. to voice them at the beginning, I guess we wouldn't really notice. So yeah. it's just kind of, you know, what if, you know. I mean, if we change now, it'd be weird. It, it, yeah. But, yeah. The voices would, like, change majorly. Exactly, yeah. Like, Sonic starts off, hey, Sonic, how's it going? And then he's like, hey, Sonic, how's it going? All right, but uh, Magic Wolf asks, to B-Boy, do you believe in the Tails doll? Like <laughs> like a religion or something? <laughs> Not really, no. It's a, it's a video game character, man, sorry. 
Uh, let's see. Nintendo Lover 0620 to both. Will there be a female character or villain in the movie? Yes. I don't know. I'm not going to say who, but yeah. Uh, let's see. I'm, uh, okay, let's see. Sweetheart 686781. She says to either, will you guys keep your Sonic plushes for other videos or sell them? Yeah, we're going to keep them. Mm -hmm. Probably not for other videos, just for memory purposes. Yeah. <laughs> Keeping the cast together. Yeah, exactly. Then the two bro productions asks, "How do you have so many subscribers?" Uh, <laughs> it's I was really glad when I reached 4K, and I posted the video, so go check it out if you haven't. But uh, you know, it's it's amazing. I was really really happy how many subscribers we've great gained, and uh, it's it's great. So just great fans like you guys, and just making videos we like and when they got popular we just you know we put a lot of effort into those videos because we love doing them and uh yeah um, and it's kind of hard like it's not like we're just like give us four thousand subscribers yeah you know? yeah you know you like people will ask on your channel hey can you sub to my channel it's like you have to earn it you know mm -hmm. like just make Videos, Cause like, look so. at how many he's made, like on a channel. It's <laughs> yeah, like and I didn't ask over a hundred. So. Yeah. No one like here's just a little advice. No one like wants a beggar, you know. Like if you beg people to subscribe to you, they'll, it'll just come off as annoying. Mm -hmm. But yeah, uh, uh, big Sonic World. He asks, would you like to do a collab together? If that's okay with you, uh, that would be interesting. But uh, we might we're doing some projects of our own. But if the thing, I don't know what you mean by collab, like coming together and doing a video, but. I don't know, maybe maybe in the future. Let's see, uh Lee Doxtator <laughs> asks I'm sorry if I butchered your name again, but uh he says, I got a question. What inspired the Tales Doll Curse series? Uh It was a time around Tales Doll, you know, it was really popular. Mm -hmm. And um That was made the Tales Doll Curse was two thousand eleven, so Yeah, yeah. That was around the time when the like mm -hmm. for some reason it got really big, like it's a game from the late nineties and all of a sudden, whoa, yeah. Tales Doll, you know. And then it's just kinda like, eh. <laughs> yeah. Now it's I mean it's still popular, I guess cause we're still getting I don't know, but you know what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. I guess we made it at the right time because it's like our most popular video, so yeah. Uh, Rafa Gamers Productions, or RGP, whatever you want to go by, he says, for both of us, will you both start a gaming channel? Well, <laughs> we actually did with our yeah. friend Mitchell, Mega Pie Guy 314 you might know him, I don't know, but we made one video, so we need, <laughs> to, add, yeah, we need to add some more coming here pretty soon, but uh, yeah, hopefully add more in the future. Um, Big Sonic World says, how much is your Sonic plushes cost? Uh, they kind of range, you know. Shadow was pretty cheap. I got him at, uh, Toys R Us, I think, like, three years, four years ago. Sonic and the gang were actually pretty expensive. They were, like, $20 each. Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles, that is. And then the Mario ones are pretty, not too bad. I kind of forget how much they were, but... And Miles Per Hour. Well, we have two Miles Per Hours. Which one's the imposter? <laughs> it says, Is it fun doing your videos? And who is the hardest and easiest voices to both of us? Yeah, it's fun doing every day, you know. I love them, you know. We wouldn't still be making them today if we didn't like them, but, uh, yeah. What do you say, hardest voices? Hmm. I mean, it's like, there's been so many. I'd probably have to say... <laughs> Peach? Peach. Yeah. Cause, oh, like, yeah, our, Peach is hard. Because we're guys, so we have to be like, yay! Yeah, I'm like, oh, Mario! You know, like, so, someone actually commented in the video, X's Part 2, I think it was. They are like, whoa, that's a weird voice for Peach. But yeah, and then, like, we need to get Ramona, your sister, back on the job or something. Cause... And then, like, Shadow. I mean, he's not really hard, but it's just like, Sonic. You know, like, yeah, it's hard exactly. making noise going yeah. that low. And then, I know he's not a huge character, but the guy behind the door in Exodus Part 3, uh, arguing to Tails about, uh, what was it, uh, switched at birth. Oh, He's yeah. Like, Season 2 was one of the best things yeah. I've ever seen on television. Like, you'll, <laughs> bite, you'll, you'll bite your tongue, you yeah, are. Yeah, my voice just cracked <laughs> doing it, but he was really fun to do. And then, uh, he was hard, though, but easiest voice is probably Sonic, because I just basically use my voice, maybe like, hey, guys, how's it going? Like, you know, yeah, more like a, that. Uh -huh. But I actually went for the, uh, I know there's Jason Griffith, Griffin, uh, 
Ryan Drummond and uh, Roger Smith or whatever his name is. They all voice Sonic. I go for the more Ryan Drummond one. But uh, yeah, the one who's like Sonic Adventure 1 and 2 and stuff. But yeah. So yeah, what would you say the easiest voice is? Probably Tails. Tails. He's, oh, yeah, he's most see. like my voice. He's like, yeah, yeah. I don't know why that is. The characters that yeah. are our main characters are just basically our voices. But mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, so we're gonna move to the next video. So stay tuned. All right, we're back. Yeah, we're back. Okay. So Sonic Plushy Bros. Twenty One. He asks, "Will you make a new series?" Yes, yes. we will. Yeah. It's a you know, secret project. Hard. Yeah, it? secret project two thousand fourteen. Go check out the trailer because oh, we just gave away some information. Oh. But that's okay. Yeah, nothing yeah. <laughs> nothing too huge because, I mean, obviously, it's, you know, I don't know. But, you know, we love doing series, so definitely we're going to make it. Whether it's this year, prob we're probably going to do it in the fall or something, mm -hmm. start it at least. But, yeah. Okay, this one's not really a question, so we'll move on. Zobi and me, he asks, how old were you when you made your first video, and can you show it? You know, it'd be really hard to show because it's on a really old home video camera. But the first video I ever made, it's really bad, but it's fun to watch because I was so little. I was like five years old, and uh, it's just me, and I have a Spider-Man plush. It's actually, I think it's the one, I don't know if you can see him right now. I think, uh, no, probably I think, not. I think he's in the closet back there or something, but... Uh, yeah, I had him. He's actually in Sonic and Tails Insane Adventures. And uh, <laughs> I was just running around the house with that. And um, I would, like, just see random stuff. And, like, I kicked the juice box over or stuff like that. <laughs> Pretty random stuff. But, yeah, it's fun to watch. I don't know. If I find a way to post it, I guess I will. But it's probably a little hard. It's not at the top of my uh, priorities. But, I mean, it'd be, that'd be fun to post on YouTube. But, yeah. Let's see, uh, oh yeah, I guess, did you make a video by yourself or something like, before? Or? Not really. Yeah. So yeah, yeah, I don't know, it's been something I've been interested in for a long time. Uh, Quub and Jam 1101 asks, this is my question, what, why should Exodus be the end of Sonic and Tails Insane Adventures series? Why can't you make more? Well... The Sonic and Tails Insane movie, that's the end, not yeah. Exodus. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Wait, do you have anything to add? I mean, it says, why can't you make more? Well, we just want to end it at the perfect spot, you know? Oh, yeah, that's true, yeah. They were... Just like we said earlier, you know, what, be, you know, there's a saying, you beat a dead horse too much, it gets old. I don't know. <laughs> that's kind of sick, because I don't know if it'd be fun in the I first don't, place. I don't really want to beat a dead horse. Yeah. When you end Insane Adventures, what kind of stuff are you going to do? Um... Well, basically, shorts, funny shorts, comedy-based, pretty much, and pretty much, pretty much, and uh, a series later down the line. So that's something to look forward to. Yeah. Uh, can Rouge and Silver make them both good? Please be in an episode. Uh, well, we're, done we're kind of done yeah. scripting already. Yeah. yeah, the movie's basically scripted. Mm -hmm. Like I said, a Rouge plush is a hundred dollars, <laughs> basically, and Silver, I don't know. It. Just, I don't know. It'd just be weird. Just yeah, like, they just oh, come out of nowhere. So, hey, yeah. guys, how's it going? You know, it just put, you know, we don't want to have too much on the table, you know, to make mm -hmm. it too, like, you know, uh, filled, I guess, clustered. Oh, yeah, that was Hunter Gibbs, by the way, who asked that. Uh, Pablo Morales can, oh, wait, no. Hunter Gibbs was the one who asked. When you, when you end in St. Adventures. Okay, sorry. And then Pablo Morales asked about Sonic, uh, Silver and Rouge. Wow, I'm not able to talk today. All right, Spin Dash Pro 20. He says to B Boy Studio, what what's your favorite game console? You know, that's a tough one. I don't know. I I the Dreamcast. That's a good one. That's probably a good classic one. The Nintendo 64, first one I ever played. So that's up there. Uh, I would say my favorite constant systems probably the PS3. And then the Wii's close. A lot of people don't like the Wii. It gets a lot of crap, but you know, I like it. There's a lot of good games in there. And then um, Spencer Smith says, I really don't want y'all the insane <gasps> adventures, but I guess it's a good time to end some things, you know? Yeah, I agree with mm -hmm. you, Spencer. Um, let's see. Out Care Werner. I don't know how to pronounce <laughs> that. How long does it take you to make a Sonic and Tails Insane Adventures video? 
awesome video in uh, parentheses. Well, thanks for that awesome video parentheses thing. Uh, how long does it take us? We answered it down below earlier in, earlier in the video, but uh, basically, you know... Probably like a week, two weeks, maybe. Yeah. I would say to make a adventures video, X this video a month, mm -hmm. maybe two weeks. It depends how much free time we have on our yeah. hands. During school, it's kind of hard. And that's really usually hard. when most of the episodes were, mm -hmm. too. Because, so, yeah. like, with sports and stuff. And yeah, homework, exactly, yeah. Basically, mm -hmm. the only day we can hang out is, like, Saturday, maybe. Yeah, Saturday. Maybe Sometimes a little the bit, week, yeah. you know, yeah. But uh, it helps that we live close, you mm -hmm. know, so... Uh, I and Pancake Z zero seven eight. He says, "What what was the most fun thing to record? Uh, definitely the insane series mm -hmm. so far, at least, because uh, yeah, just you know, fun the film. We do a lot of jokes yeah. in between. Oh, sorry, man. Uh, we do a lot of jokes in between. Uh, you know, filming. You have anything to add? Not really. I mean, it's yeah. just fun. Mm -hmm. All around fun." Let's see, will you add any super characters, like Super Sonic, Tails, Knuckles, etc.? Uh, probably not, because <clears throat> if you watch the end of Exodus Part 3, Tails though already s engulfed all of the seven Chaos Emeralds, so there's no one else for them to go <laughs> to, so yeah. Uh, probably not. Maybe. You never know. Oh yeah, that was Miranda Zuzek, by the way. I saved myself from making the same problem, so... Alright, let's see. Minecraft and Sonic. He says, Sonic and Mario V slash D. I don't know what you mean. Sorry, Sorry man. Yeah. You gotta... Thanks for posting your question, but uh, we have no idea what you mean by that. Sorry. Uh, maybe specify a bit. <laughs> okay, let's see. Sonic Pro 39. He says, how do you edit Sonic videos like, <laughs> like Exodus? Well, I don't know why I'm laughing, but <laughs> Exodus... I uh, edited it with... Why am I laughing? I, I used Pinnacle Studios. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right. okay. I use uh, Pinnacle Studio for... Uh... <laughs> Simon, shut up. I use Pinnacle Studio for uh, Exodus and stuff. And then for the earlier episodes, I use stuff like uh, iMovie. You know, they're both really good. But... <laughs> why? This isn't even funny. Okay, but uh, I use iMovie for uh, earlier episodes. They're both really good. iMovie, you know, it's more simple. Then Pinnacle's more complex, but it's really good. It pays off if you learn to use it. All right. David Warino says, After Sonic and Tails' insane movie, will you guys stop making Sonic plush videos forever? No. And also, could you post the trailer for the insane movie? Well, for the trailer part, uh, probably a teaser trailer. We don't have any footage yet. But, uh, for the insane movie, we're probably going to be done with plush videos. Maybe shorts. We might make shorts. Yeah, something like, like possibly, that. Possibly? Yeah, but, but probably not. Sorry. We're still going to make videos, though. They're mm -hmm. going to be funny. A lot like Insane Adventures, so yeah. yeah. Um, let's see. Dragon Destroyer 1010. Ooh, destroys dragons. Ooh. It's going to be intense. I'm scared. He said, yeah. <laughs> Will there be anything similar to Sonic and Tails and Saint Adventures that you will be doing? Uh, you know, there's n no more plush stuff, but I mean, as far as like story and comedy go, you know, there's going to be stuff very, very similar to Insane Adventures. So stay tuned for that. Um, <clears throat> Outcare Venora says, H "Here's a little recommendation for Sonic and Tails and Saint movie. Shadow is sitting in a tree with a gun." Someone random, someone random walks by and he says, "Time to start target practice." That'd be pretty we, funny. We might. Yeah, we might. Basically, maybe, the yeah. whole thing yeah. scripted out, but that's a funny idea. So, mm. if you make videos like that, you could do something like that. That'd be pretty funny. Yeah. SBF plays says four thousand subs. Congrats, man. Jesus, I wish I could get that. The first one thousand is always the hardest. You know it is. The first one thousand is the hardest. And, uh, yeah, so thanks, man. But, uh, yeah, if uh, you're waiting on getting those subs up there, just keep doing what you're doing, because, yeah, you'll get there. And uh, Chris plus Tony Games says, you can't end Sonic and Tails Insane Adventures. Well, That's not really we can. Question. But... Yeah, we can, but, uh, so <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I don't know, it's just like we said er <laughs> like we said earlier. Basically 
there's no point of uh, keep keeping it up because you know we're gonna run out of ideas soon. Yeah, and I just hear it's like better, you said. It's the perfect time to end it. You know? Yeah, exactly. Like you don't want to keep doing something because it'll get old. You know. Uh, Marcelo Sanchez says, "Please don't stop the song in Saint Adventures, please." Sorry, we're man. sorry, man. <laughs> yeah, just something that has to happen. You know. Uh, Car King one one four says, "Hey Brian and Simon, I have a question. Where did you meet each other?" Well, That's actually, his neighbor, like I was friends with him, so I'd go over there. Mm -hmm. And when he moved in the neighborhood, he would go over there. Yeah, we, we didn't. We actually didn't yeah. really like each other at all. <laughs> but uh, I like. I don't know. I guess I don't know why we didn't like each other. So now we're like best friends. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, pal. <laughs> but yeah, so basically, basically, yeah, just kind of met in the neighborhood, and it's been like six Seven, years now. Six, I would say more six, yeah, maybe six, six and a half, but it's crazy. We met. How long? We met in two thousand nine. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah, man, that's weird. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, okay, let's see. Um, Sonic Plushy Bros twenty one. He says, "Will you make a new series?" Yes, we will because. Uh, yeah, if you see in the Secret Project 2014, that's going to be the new series, basically. So, yeah. Um, Sonic Pro 39. Oh, okay, that's not a question. You just said to B-Boy. I think he made a, like, a mistake or something. Spencer Smith says, Is Super Sonic going to be in the insane movie? Uh, like we said earlier, probably not, because Tails Doll took all the emeralds. So, maybe, you never know, but it's pretty unlikely. Spencer Smith again, he says, how long is the insane movie going to be? Uh, like we said earlier, probably just an hour. Not super long, but, you know, longer than an episode. Yeah. SonicFan77 says, cool! Thanks, man. Thanks. <laughs> Miles Prower, who inspired you to make all these videos? Uh, you know, a lot of uh, YouTubers, I guess. Mario Mario 8989, like we said. I guess Super Mario Logan was one of them. Oh, yeah, you know. I him. Yeah, and um, just, they seem fun, and they are, so mm -hmm. yeah. SonicFan77 says, do you like LM MLP, which is My, My Little, Little Pony, Pony, right? Uh, he says, I don't. Oh, Sonic I Rocks. Don't yeah, me neither. I'm not a brony. My sister, she's obsessed with it. It's so <laughs> annoying. He says, how did you find out about stop-motion animation? Um... Uh, you know, I said it earlier, just, uh, Sonic Toast, Super Sonic Boom, and they, it looked fun. And also the Tim Burton movies, stuff like that, Nightmare, Nightmare oh, yeah. Before Christmas, stuff like that. That's pretty motion. talented. Like. It is. It takes a lot of effort mm -hmm. and patience, lots of patience. If you're going into stop motion, you can't, you have to have a, you can't have a short attention span. You have to be, move it a little bit, take the next picture, especially if you're alone. It's pretty, it gets tedious, but it's fun. It pays off. Do you like MJ? Michael Jordan or Michael Jackson? Both, yes, but yeah. So, how about you? You like MJ? Uh, I mean, my, yeah, Michael Jordan's cool. Michael Jackson. I mean, oh, wait. If you look later, it says Michael Jackson. So, oh, okay. I'm guessing you mean Michael Jackson. I mean, I didn't really like him as a person too much, but I thought his music was pretty good. Yeah, I really like his music, and I don't know. He got a lot of uh, hate. I didn't think he was awful. There's been much worse people, <clears throat> Justin Bieber. But uh, anyways, which song is your favorite from Michael Jackson? Um, huh. I'd say uh, Beat It. Yeah, I, beat I really it's like good. rock and roll better than pop. I yeah, mean. I like Thriller too. Thriller's good. And then uh, uh, Billie Jean. Billie that's Jean. A good one. Yeah. <clears throat> so he says, rest in peace, the king of pop. Yeah, I mm -hmm. agree. He is the king of pop. Yeah. Justin not Bieber's Justin like, oh, hey, I'm the I king of pop, it. but in honesty, no, you're he's, just a little... He's the king of whistles. Yeah, he's the king of people that you don't like. That was kind of lame, but, uh, yeah, <laughs> I, I could have came up with a better name, but, oh, well. Do you eat like Goku? I don't uh, know how Goku uh, eats, so I, haven't really, I don't know. I haven't really seen if Dragon maybe Ball Z. I'm, like that, I don't know. I eat with my mouth. Yeah, yeah, usually basically straightforward. Mm -hmm. Do you wish you like MJ? Well, I do Maybe. like MJ, so, I mean... <laughs> do you wish you were like MJ? Oh, do you wish Maybe. you were like MJ? I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know if I want to yeah. hold my baby over a building, but... Yeah. Let's see. Do you think Silver the Hedgehog is gay? Uh, not I really. Mean, I, I mean, never... he's with Blaze. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I guess he kind of sounds... 
I don't know. I mean, I don't really know. I don't, I don't really. I don't really care. If, <laughs> yeah, I don't really guess the homosexuality yeah. of the characters, but uh, nah. I think he likes plays. Maybe they're friends. Maybe they're more than friends. I don't know. Uh, Lee. Oh yeah, that was Lauren Clark, by the way. And then um, Lee D Doc's Tater has a question. He says, "What inspired the Tales Doll Terror series, and do you still have the Paper Tales Doll?" Uh. Like we said earlier, it was just popular when we made the Tales Doll whole Tales Doll mythos thing was popular when we made uh, the Tales Doll Terror series. And yeah, so. And do you still have the paper Tales Doll? Nah. Uh, I mean, I wish we did. I kind of wish we did. But you know, after Tales Doll Terror Part 2, we just ripped it up in the shreds, you know, after the explosion. Mm -hmm. So we just kind of threw it away. <laughs> And then Exodus, we just printed out another, ripped it in the shreds. So I, I thought that was a cool idea, you know, because always oh, back, you know. Let's see, Rafa Gamers Productions or RGP, whatever he wants to go by. July 5th is also a time where you can make a picture of Sonic destroying a badnik while taking a selfie. Thank you for that. <laughs> I don't know if that was a question or not, but uh, Moogie616 says, Why can't Spider-Man die and never come back? Uh, well, Spider-Man actually has died and come back several times, actually. Um, but yeah, so that hopefully that answers your question. Um, Mataniac Stewart, sorry if I butchered your name. How did you think of the idea for Insane Adventures? Like, again, boredom, boredom <laughs> struck us, and we just made it. The first, very first episodes weren't scripted at all, and uh, <laughs> now they are. And uh, so they're a little better... Mm -hmm. In my opinion, at least. But, uh, yeah. So, let's see. Lauren Clark says... "How? Oh, wow, we're getting close to the end. Lauren Clark says, How did you find out about the Tails doll? Uh, well, I basically... When we... I got Sonic Gems collection. And when I was playing Sonic R, I just kind of knew about that. And then I started seeing this stuff like... <laughs> the Tails doll curse. Like, if you look in the mirror, say his name three times while holding the pie or something. <laughs> he'll appear... And holding I was like, a pie what? and writing a unisex. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's pretty tedious. And then, like, when it doesn't work, they'll be like, oh, well, uh, you know, you needed to be doing this, too, you know? I mean, we've tried the mm -hmm. where you tag him with Supersonic or something At like 11.40. Yeah. It's, it's and, then, really... and then after we did that, they're like, oh, you know, well, people are like, you know, you need to uh, have the actual Sonic R, Sega Saturn. You know, I'm not going to buy a Sega Saturn just to not <laughs> have to anything do happen. Just doesn't even work. <laughs> yeah. No offense to people who believe in the tail socket. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Ender Eli, Silver the Hedgehog, says, Okay, I have a question for you and Simon. Who are your f fab? I'm guessing that says means fave. Fave Mario and Sonic characters. Mine are Yoshi and Tails. Uh, my favorite Mario character, I don't know, it's always been a tie between Mario and Yoshi. Sonic is Sonic and Tails, so yeah, pretty straightforward. How my, about you? My favorite Mario character is that always been a tie between Luigi and Yoshi. Oh yeah, Luigi's good. Uh, and then Sonic, I'd probably have to say Shadow. Yeah, Shadow's cool. Shadow's pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, well, Lauren Clark said Sonic Boom is not grabbing my attention. How about you? Um... You said earlier Sonic Boom looks a little cool. I don't know. It just I don't know. I, I mean, mean, it might it, be cool. They got naughty some Naughty Dog employees mm -hmm. doing it, and it, I don't know. It doesn't really look like the commercials don't look too good. Yeah, and something that I thought was really weird when you saw the first trailer, it was like, oh, look at this, and there was these crazy graphics and stuff, and like, I mean, I know graphics aren't everything, and then like, there's really it looked like cool, and now like it just. It looks like it downgraded for some reason. Like now, it looked like a like a next gen Wii U game, like legit. But now it kind of looks like a PS2 game. So, mm -hmm. I mean, I it know. might it might be fun. Like the gameplay might be fun. Yeah, but I feel like it's something that won't be like you know. I'll have to get used to it. Like it'll yeah. grow on me, maybe. I I would definitely wait to uh, till the price drops to get it. Like, it, it's not my top priority. My top priority yeah. is, like, Super Smash Bros. 4, Pikmin 3, Wind Waker Remake, and then... Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And uh, Super Mario 3D World, Mario Kart. I have yet to get a Wii U. I really need to get one for that new Smash Bros. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> um, to be honest, I love Sonic, but 
If I would say there's any Wii U game that's at the bottom of the barrel, it would be Sonic Boom. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I, I mean, hate to say it, it might but be, it just doesn't it might be look a good, too good in my It might opinion. be a good game, but it doesn't look as good as the other Wii U games. I know, yeah, yeah. And, I don't know. Sonic uh, Lost World, I heard, that wasn't as good as I thought. Mm -hmm. Cause, which is a shame, because it looked pretty cool. But I don't know, I think... They were doing so well because uh, they had Sonic, Sonic Unleashed, Sonic Colors, Sonic Generations, you know. They had that formula down, and then they changed it. I don't understand. I mean, that's cool. You want to, like, vary your stuff, you know. But make sure but it's good. Like, yeah. like, keep the elements. Like, what, like, Nintendo does. Like, they keep the main idea, and then they add new elements mm -hmm. to shake things up so it's not the same. But they still have what people love. So I think Sega needs to get that down because they've been jumping around way too much with Sonic. Okay, well, let's see. Some comments are hidden. You want to see the hidden comments? The hidden comments. <laughs> okay, I have a question for you and Simon from Ender Eli Silver the Hedgehog. Oh. Wait, this is... Yeah, it's the same one. And then Lauren Clark is down here replying to that, so I guess I'll unmark them, approve them or whatever. I don't yeah. know why. <laughs> okay, yeah, I don't know what's so wrong with those comments, but uh, for them to be hidden... <laughs> But, uh, yeah, that's basically all. Do you want to check this little bell thing, see if there's anything else? Sure. Uh, nothing on the Q&A, so... Yeah. Well... Thanks for the questions, guys. Mm -hmm. It was really fun doing this video. It yeah, went I, by fast. I it's hope like we, our longest yeah. video. I hope we don't exceed the maximum limit. I hope we answered all your questions fine. Yeah, yeah. Just uh, Sorry hopefully. to the people that, like, we didn't really get your questions. Yeah, if we didn't understand mm -hmm. them. And uh, if you made questions after this video was made, sorry if we didn't get to them. Maybe I'll... What I'll do is I'll answer them in the comments or something, but sorry they didn't get to the actual video. But, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. This was a fun video to do. I had mm -hmm. fun with this one. Mm -hmm. It was really cool seeing you guys' question. I'm glad you're all interested in everything. So, uh, yeah, just stay tuned for uh, Sonic and Tails' insane movie. Cause now that the, Coming out soon. Ooh, will hurt my pinky. Now that, yeah, oh, yeah, right. yeah, now that the script's all done, uh, just basically film, edit, hopefully have it out by August. I was thinking maybe July, but, you know, it's, it's July 10th, yeah. so... We don't want to rush it too August. much. Maybe even like what's after September? September, September yeah, mm -hmm. maybe September. So yeah. Sorry, we don't we don't want to get it out like oh we gotta film this very quick. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like hurry, really, like yeah. make it, and then it hey, comes out and it's crappy. We you know? really we really want to make it good for you guys. Yeah, I think the insane series really needs to have good closure. So yeah, so hopefully we answered all your questions and uh. We might do a video like this in the future. My voice just echoed. It sounds like I'm in a cave or something. But, <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so we might do a video like this in the future. Probably no time soon, but it was definitely fun. I had, I had a good time doing this. Mm -hmm.